Well, our next guest says that the key to weight loss is to forget about how fat people diet, but to instead focus on how slim people eat. For more on this revolutionary new concept, we're joined by the author of Fat Chance, Susan Mayava. Good morning, Susan. Thank you for joining Good us. Good morning, Tony. Your workbook here, you saw a gap in the market, didn't you? Because I've read a lot of dieting books and this is how you're supposed to do it but this is interactive is that the key difference about this book that that is one of the key differences it's very much a workbook that the reader engages with um, it's a 12-week program so it gives the reader time to to engage with issues at a very personal and intimate level um, and time to um, embed new skills and new strategies because it's really about a lifestyle change it's, it's actually not about dieting because diets um, go for a time, they finish, um, and then often the, the person hasn't gained the new habits or um, the new lifestyle, and they go back to their old ways. And unfortunately, many people find that the weight comes back on. The difference here with this book is that from day one, you're actually starting a new lifestyle, and you're uh, taking on board the habits and the strategies of, of slim people, and slim becomes the new norm. It's, you, you think of yourself from day one as a slim person. And if you do that, you begin to act accordingly. How do slim people eat? What are the key points? Let me know. I want to know. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, one of the key things, there, there, there are a number. Um, slim people don't have food as, as a priority in their life. They don't use food to meet their emotional needs. Um, they, they don't eat unless they're hungry, and they use hunger as a cue to tell them when to eat. And they also, um, without realising it, they eat the number of calories each day to maintain their slim weight. So that's one of the things that this book starts with. It, it, um, the reader, actually on day one, has to calculate the number of calories they should be eating each day to maintain their slim weight. Not their current weight, but their slim weight, and, and start there. In fact, I've actually just... That is, a, that is a calculation, um, and I've actually just put that on my website, fatchance.co.nz. So, so anybody can, in fact, go to um, the page on my website that says uh, Slim Weight Calorie Calculator, and, and, they, can, it and they can, it, it, will, it will do it for them. It will calculate the number of calories they should be eating each day um, to maintain their slim weight. That sounds really good in theory about not wanting to focus on food, but what if it's, it's birthdays, it's celebration, it's like, oh, we deserve a treat. Is that, you're telling us, don't do that, change your thinking to this is just going to fuel my body? Is that the whole concept? Yes, and to think of treats in other ways as well. Um, treats can be having a nice a bath with, with perfume and candles, or, or going into the garden and picking yourself a bunch of flowers, or in fact getting exercise, and we have to think of exercise differently as well, that, that um, enjoying the use of your body um, to do the things you want to do in your life is a treat. So changing your whole mindset. Susan Very Marla, much. thank you so much for joining us, and just to reiterate again, fatchance.co.nz, yes, and yes. you can calculate the calories, I might have to yes, do that today yes. before I eat my uh, brunch. <laughs> thank you very much. Thanks, Susan. <laughs> Want to lose weight? Discover how to think and eat like a slim person forever with Fat Chance, the no going back weight loss workbook. The wait is over. Order your copy online today at fatchance.co.nz.